Today I show you how to erase your iPad with the iCloud with the erase option from the Find My Network from Find My Device. Today I show you how to remote wipe your iPad using the Find My Network, the iCloud lock. You have your iPad in your Apple account and the reason why I did this was that the iPad was frozen, it was stuck, it wouldn't respond, there was no response other than the control center to set Apple mode on and off and connect to the Wi-Fi. The apps were not opening, not like that, and this is the information here of the iPad and that's the model, that's the model number there and you don't really need to have the iPad. The, the, the remote wipe or erase option in iCloud in the Find My app is made so that you, if you if you lost the iPad and you don't think there is much of a chance to get it back, to make sure that the data doesn't stay on the iPad and in case something someone finds it, you could even leave a phone number there so they could see the phone number and they could call you. Don't erase the iPad this way if you're trying to sell the iPad or give it to someone because they will need to enter your Apple account. So that's another option. This is another way to do it. This case here to remote wipe the iPad is for the protection of your account and also so that whoever finds the iPad, they cannot use it unless they have your Apple account password. It's for someone, you lost the iPad basically. And in case someone finds it, they have an option to see your phone number. Also, there is an option where you don't erase the iPad and you wait for someone to find it. Like that, you also see the location of the iPad, you know where it is. If you do the erase option, if you erase the iPad, you will not see anymore where the iPad is and that might be not such a great idea. If you think that there is a chance that someone